writing the novel was to find a way to immerse myself in the history and learn about it and come to understand it and appreciate it and see my way through it without being without drowning in it or or, or killing the the narrative momentum by delving too much into detail when it was only necessary to show a little. If you went from Whitehorse to Victoria to St. John's, you'd be hard pressed to find one grade 11 student who couldn't tell you at least a paragraph or two about the uh, civil rights movement in the United States, about slavery in the United States, about abolition in the US. But you'd be uh, equally hard pressed to find one out of a thousand of those students who could tell you anything about black history in Canada. We still stock our school curricula with To Kill a Mockingbird instead of uh, Canadian fiction dramatizing uh, Canadian history and African Canadian history. We are giving a presentation later today. It's called Kicking the Mockingbird Habit because it's been such a fixture in, uh, in our secondary schools in Canada. One of the books we're proposing to kick the Mockingbird Habit is The Book of Negroes by Lawrence Hill, a very kind and gracious author. Any attempt to sort of bring these matters to Canadian consciousness is good and if some of that unfolds in Black History Month so much the better. It can get a bit extreme sometimes. People might invite you for February and if you say you're not available in February. There's no other time to consider bringing you. So it, it can be a bit extreme to focus on February. It's the shortest, coldest month of the year. 